Good morning, everyone. Happy energy reading. I'm Terry. It's so lovely to see you again. Another day, another experience, <laughs> right? I tell ya, I tell ya. So I'm picking out four cards here so that we can take an energy temperature check to see what today's potentials and possibilities could be like. Of course, you always create your own reality with your God-given gift of free will. So choose wisely, my friends. Life is a choose-your-own-adventure book. So I'm just here to give you a tool, uh, an implementation tool to see how you could best navigate your way through the day uh, in your human experience. So if something that I say, because this is a general reading, if if there's something that I say that does not resonate with you, don't take it, toss it aside. Only take what does resonate with you. This is a general reading, like I said, so not everybody is going to understand what I say. Um, and if you do want something more private, you can go ahead and book a one-on-one -on -one with me. You can just check out terryhuberman.com. And as a matter of fact, right now, until November 1st, I'm running a 25% discount off of a 45-minute psychic reading. So if you just, on Instagram, if you just click the word book in my profile, or you just check out the link below if you're watching this on any other social media, it'll take you right to the book section where you can get that 25% discount if you use the code HALLOW, H-A-L-L-O-W-19 at checkout. But I've got my four cards here, so let's do a reveal for today and see what your day might look like today. Here we go. We have King of Diamonds back in the diamonds. La Calavera. Did we have La Calavera the other day? I feel like we had, I think we did. He's back. But it's Halloween time, so of course he'd be back. Playfulness. And we have nine of water. All right, so this is what we're dealing with today. Nine of water, playfulness, king of diamonds, and la calavera. All right, let's see how we put this guy together. So we're still in this um, potential of abundance mode, which is great. Um, so we haven't lost that. We lost it for like a day or two, and now we're back, <laughs> right? And we're back. Um, <clears throat> right. So today we're going to want to tap into that childlike, not childish, but childlike self of ours to help get us out of this adulting and serious mode. We've been adulting and we've been so serious lately. Um, I mean, and that's really because times are a lot tougher. We're being called to make so many changes. And along with developing and changing ourselves, also we get these goals, right? And these rockets of desire that we're shooting out there um, that we want to work towards because as we evolve and change, so are our goals. And a lot of times it's just to find that peace um, but in an abundance of the peace. And the way we're going to actually find that today is through being more playful. Yes, yes. Because a lot of us have been adulting, like I said, and we're taking on commitments that we really don't need to. Even in terms of, and when I say this, of a commitment about something, I'm not necessarily talking relationship commitment. I'm not necessarily talking about like, yeah, more relationship commitment. I'm talking about a commitment to importance and how important you think something is. And therefore, your commitment uh, grows and inspires. Here's the, the challenge with that and the way the universe, university, <laughs> we are an earth university. Uh, but the way uh, the universe works is the more uh, you put importance on something, you cause an excess of potential, meaning there's a lot of energy being focused on something, and it kind of sets out of whack the balance of the universe because the universe loves balance. So it's gonna send these, what are called balancing forces, and these are, 
These are the concepts and the principle of transurfing, um, which is a, they're principles of creating and manifesting the, the reality that you get to choose that you, that already exists, right? So by you making such hard commitments and adulting so much, it's putting so much of your thought process and your focus and your energy into like, if you were to look at a scale into what goes on, it's like, right? So here's your, here's what your commitment and your, um, you know, and, and what you're considering important, right? So this is not balance. Universal likes balance. So what it's going to do is it's going to put into play what's called a balance of forces and make things nice and easy. And what that is called is resistance. So if you're finding you're, you're coming along and you're finding a lot of bumps in the road, it's because you're not surrendering into the process. Today, part of that surrender comes from playing and being more playful. So it's really important for you to tap into that side of yourself today so that you can giggle, you can laugh because that breaks up energy. It puts, it, it, it stops putting so much focus and so much importance on one particular thing. So as counterintuitive as that seems and as it might feel, stop putting so much importance on adulting and on getting and making that commitment of yours and just play and just kind of set it aside and just go, right now it's not important, I'm gonna play. That is where you are gonna find that you get back into the flow and the stream where you're actually going with the stream instead of against the stream. Because right now, all that adulting is just blocking you. It's just blocking you. So so that's the really the best way how to manage today is get into that silly childlike quality and uh, side of yourself. Maybe even hang out with kiddos today. And... Um, it, and laugh and be silly and pretend and use that imagination and act just like a child acts, which will help break up all that excess energy that you're focusing on and putting so much importance to um, with that commitment or the commitments that you've gotten, that you've gotten yourself into. So um, that's really, really the best way to navigate and maneuver your way today. So the implementation tool is to get out there, laugh, play, be silly. Yes, yes, yes. What am I always saying to you guys? Stay connected, right? Stay connected to your friends and family. Stay connected to yourself. And of course, stay connected to me. I offer a soul package which helps you get out of indecision and into your intuition. It gets you unstuck moving forward again because we all have blocks. But we don't necessarily know what they are. These blind spots keep us from reaching our goals. Well, if you're interested in moving forward again, I can help you through this soul healing package that I have. There are readings, there are there is breathwork energy healings, and of course, coaching. So if that sounds like something you're up to and you're like, I want to, I just, I got to do this. I, we only have three more months left of, of this decade. You guys, we're going into 2020. Is that crazy? It's crazy. So if this sounds good to you, check out my site, Terry Huberman, go to the soul healing consult up at the top and schedule yourself a complimentary consultation to see if we would good, be a good match to work together to see if this is maybe something that you um, can finish out the year strong with. So go ahead and do that. It's complimentary consultation. And I'll see you on the flip side.